Hey what's up it's Hugo here, today I'll be doing my review on the WinX HD video converter for Mac. Of course as the title says it's a video converter, I'm gonna go ahead and show you all the features of it, what it can do and what it can't do, uh, the good and the bad things and uh, well let's get right into it shall we. Now to start converting a video with this application it's really simple, simply drag and drop your file on the converter and it will automatically analyze the video. From there you can also crop it if you want, if you want to crop the video you can set the start and the end time and it will then convert it only in the cropped area. You can also take a snapshot of any moment in the video, name it and save it wherever you want. Of course you can set the output location or folder uh, to your liking and uh, that's kind of the standard options here for video converters now. Now what really sets this converter aside is the amount of presets that are available for each and every format. Of course we have just the standard general video with uh, AVI, MP4, AVC, MPEG, WMV, .mov and as well to YouTube and all these formats of course are also available in HD quality. Now once you start converting your video, during the conversion you have some information about the video as well as two options is to open the containing folder of the output video as well as shut down your computer when the conversion is completed which is great if you're trying to convert large files during the night or uh, just before you go to sleep you set one up and uh, then it just automatically shuts down for you. Now to save you some work they've added tons of little presets of popular devices so you can directly export to your favorite device. And uh, it starts from the iPad, the iPhone, as well as the iPhone 4, uh, tons of different iPods, the Apple TV, as well as the HD quality of the Apple new Apple TV. Uh, you also have Nokia devices, Android devices, Blackberries, uh, PDAs, as well as the Zen. We've also added presets for consoles such as the PlayStation Portable, the PlayStation 3 as well as the Blu-ray quality of the PlayStation 3. Uh, and then we also have the Microsoft Xbox, Xbox HD quality as well as the Zune uh, HD quality. Now if you want to still go old school and go with DVDs you can easily do that as well and br uh, burn it on a DVD. Now for an extra you're actually able to extract music or audio off the video uh, by simply exporting it as an MP3 file. Now last but not least, you can now actually instantly convert YouTube videos simply by copy and pasting their URL. So go on your browser, copy paste the link from the video into the WinX HD video converter and it will automatically convert the video for you. Now I've done a little comparison with a few other video converter applications and I've not really noticed any noticeable difference uh, in time it takes to convert a video. So I've tried the Skysoft and the 4 Media Converter as well. Um, and there's not any, there's a few minor differences, but uh, nothing really noticeable. Averagely, it's always about the same. Um, so I haven't really taken that into account in my review since whichever video uh, converter you use, it's always roughly the same time uh, to convert a video. Now that's it for my review on the WinX HD video converter for Mac. Overall, I think it's a very decent video converter. Uh, it retails for $35, uh, that's uh, roughly about 27 euros, I think. And uh, at the moment they've got a special offer which gives you a free uh, iPhone DVD ripper uh, with it if you buy it. Now what I think is great about this application is the fact that you have tons of different presets. You can simply drag and drop, choose your device and boom, you have straight away. You don't need to hassle through options and tons of different uh, advanced settings. So that's a good thing. Uh, what I think is not that great is, is the price. I think it's a little at the pricey side of uh, for a video converter. Uh, there's a lot of video converters out there right now. and uh, you know, they kind of got to lower their price at the moment. But uh, I've noticed that they do give a lot of support and uh, they've got tons of tutorials on their website and you do get quite a lot of features with it. So eventually it comes up for the money if you use it a lot. But uh, yep, uh, I also think the name WinX uh, is not a great name for an actual Mac application since it kind of remembers me of Windows. But that's totally my personal opinion. <laughs> I do think still the application itself, as I mentioned in my review, has tons of great features for it. So that's good. I'll be posting a link in the description where you can just overview the application. They've got quite a good uh, in description as well uh, on their website. And uh, be sure to stay tuned for a giveaway I'll be holding. Uh, there will be I'll be giving away a few of the copies of uh, this application, and uh, that's going to be uh, coming up pretty soon. So. I'll thank you a lot for watching and uh, be sure to follow me on Twitter, be sure to become a fan or at least like me on Facebook, I kind of got this new uh, Facebook page, you can just look me up on Facebook or just leave a link in the description. And uh, again, I'll thank you a lot for watching and I'll see you guys later, peace.